plants have many forms of defence against herbivores. Thick, waxy cuticles, poisonous leaves, spines and hairs, and even defensive scents known as HIPVs. HIPVs, or herbivore-induced plant volatiles, are specific combinations of chemicals which are thought to indirectly reduce herbivore activity. How do they do this? These chemicals are produced when herbivores attack a plant. They attract a variety of organisms, a major group being the predators of insects, like birds. Dr Ivan Hiltpold and Dr Greg Shriver from the University of Delaware tested this hypothesis in an agricultural setting. Firstly, artificial dispensers which mimicked the HIPVs were deployed in two fields of maize. Clay caterpillars were then attached to the maize as decoy bait. The scientists measured the frequency and severity of bird attacks on the decoy caterpillars. The results were clear. Where HIPVs rather than the control solvent were dispersed, bird attacks were much more frequent and the peck rate per attack was significantly higher. This demonstrates that birds use the plant volatiles as a way to locate insect prey. It also supports, for the first time in an agricultural setting, the importance of a sense of smell or olfactory response in birds a topic that has many further applications. This work has important implications for agroecology. By providing habitat for birds, farmers can increase their numbers. An increase in birds could lead to a reduction in the pest population, which could benefit crop production. So even small changes in the landscape around crop fields by maintaining or creating wildlife habitats can benefit both the farmer and the wildlife. More research is needed, but this is a highly promising avenue in the world of agroecology.